Alright, so this is my new YouTube channel. And it's going to be dedicated to my RC car. Um this isn't necessarily an on-road car. It was built to drift. And uh, I'm just going to be talking about what it has, what I've done to it, um, how it performs. Just uh, the reason why I decided to make this today was because I had my car, the front end, snapped, front end of the chassis snapped after smashing into, into a curb really hard. Um, and that was pretty much the part that held up the two front body posts. So, I replaced it. And I pretty much had to swap every little thing off here. Except for a couple things. Under the new chassis. So that was done quite recently. Uh, another thing that I had to do was, um, the, on the servo. <laughs> get this off on the uh, servo like these two ends on the other side broke off so I had to order a uh, new top for that uh, but now that I have it in my hands I'm running a Novak ballistic eight and a half turn motor with a Havoc Pro SC ESC uh, Onyx 7.4 two cell lipo 4000 milliamps right there uh, my pulleys I've been trying really really hard to find like a counter steer kit for like 1.5 looking for like a 25 um, like pulley middle pulley I've already got the uh, 33 tooth front diff pulley in a bag um, I have the Team Bomber kit, carbon fiber kit, uh, aluminum hub, can you, hub, hubs, or, I know, I think these are the hub carriers, but, that's that, um, I have zero toe in the front, and two toe in the back, as far as angle, um, you know, I... I think it's the Team Yokomo titanium, titanium, uh, uh, man, I'm off my game today, uh, whatever, I can't remember what they're called right now, anyway, that's that, um, as far as remote control, I have a DX3R, um, I'm actually was using it as a mount, but DX3R. Uh, put camera back on. Uh, actually, if you guys know the website Janky Dory Dory, um, I ordered some parts off there. Like, I ordered uh, new wheels and rims because after a while, just the inside thread of the tire will just not grip anymore, so it's sort of bad. I think the rims are good, but I'm just one of those guys that just gets tired of the same rims, and they're only like 20 bucks for a set of four, so just ordered some more. <laughs> I ordered a um, 180SX body. I will tell you why later. Um, but anyways, if someone wants these rims... Uh, just let me know. I'll send them to you for free. Uh, just pay for like three dollars shipping or whatever. Um, so yeah, I can't really say how it performs right now. I've, I mean, I've obviously driven it before and it handles really, really well. Um, but the only thing that I would want to do is maybe get those counter steer gears. So if anybody out there has a Yokomo BD counter steer gear kit, just let me know and uh, I'll try and get it off of you. Um, well, 
the old body I was using was this piece of junk. Pretty much uh, had that. And this thing has been through some uh, some wicked crashes. You know, I don't know if you guys also drift, but you know, every time you get a new body, you're always like, oh, okay. You know, this is just gonna be for show. But then you just use it and you just start crashing it. But uh, this new body that I'm getting, hopefully, I can keep in good shape. I've got big plans for it, but uh. All this, all these stripes came pre-painted. I just sort of did like the inside body color. Um, so yeah, that, that's that for the body. Um, these are pretty much all the gears that I have. All the pulleys. Just a bunch of random diffs, spools, pulleys, spur gears, pinions bunch of stuff, and, um, I got a bunch of different, like, uh, you know, toe adjustments for the rear and the front, I got a couple, uh, turn buckles, or whatever they're called in there, some, uh, steering, like the steering racks, or whatever, like, right here, to make it move, uh, and as far as the tools that I use, um, I'm loving the low C tools. These are my nut drivers. And I got uh, a set of four Allen wrenches. These are just amazing. I know Dynamite Tools make some really nice ones. But I like these and I have them, so I use them. Obviously. Now, uh, why I'm getting a 180SX body, uh, they don't make the 240SX bodies, but, uh, I have a 240SX in real life, and this thing is a beast, so I'm gonna be making videos of this, um, but this is mine, daily, daily dream, uh, just a bunch of stuff. I'm going to be making a lot of videos on this, like, a lot. I'm not going to go over everything it has right now, because, you know, I just need another video, but, uh, if you guys like this, full roll cage, pretty much gutted, um, Cusco strut bar, subs, just for fun, built by, uh, Dark Side. So, uh, I'll make another video on that. But, going back. The, uh, Drift RC. It's pretty much one of my favorite things to do in my free time. So, just wanted to give you a rundown of what it was and, uh, what I'll be doing with it. And, hopefully in a few days I'll be making a, uh, making another video of it running, because I don't have my wheels right now, they're coming in the mail, all the way from Hong Kong, and whoever knows about that, it takes forever to get here, um, I mean, I could, let's see here, it does turn on, on my radio. See, another problem I'm having is... Well, okay. The reason why it's making so much noise right now is because I haven't adjusted the uh, servo yet. But every time I turn it, it just wants to... just wants to move! So I think I'm going to glue it down. But, uh, still got some work. I don't know what's up with this. I haven't, I 
finished building this this morning, but still got some work. Anyways, um, watch the next video.